Driving on Kansas State Highway 99 in northeast Kansas, you might notice this curved section in the road. While the curve won't be there much longer, the state is spending $18 million approved in this year's state budget to straighten the four-mile stretch from Interstate 70 down to Amigo. We think the impact is going to be very dramatic for us as, as it relates to future development. The Highway 99 project is one of two road projects Governor Jeff Collier and Transportation Secretary Richard Carlson announced Wednesday. We're excited. In Pittsburgh. The governor announced resuming work on turning an 11 and a half mile stretch of US 69 from Bourbon County to Crawford County into a four lane freeway. One reason is the transportation flow. The $57 million project was included in this year's budget and is one of two dozen projects delayed in 2016 by then Governor Sam Brownback as a way to balance the state's budget. Whenever we can help improve the transportation and infrastructure, uh, we certainly try to do so. Now, we've been rather limited in funds the last few years. The U.S. 69 announcement drew criticism from Senate Minority Leader Anthony Hensley. Hensley calls the expansion a campaign stunt, saying the Brownback Collier administration swept $3.2 billion from the highway fund, resulting in the delay of the project. Collier dismissed that accusation. These are infrastructure projects that are absolutely critical for us, and they're really going to move the football. As for the 22 other projects delayed, Carlson says KDOT is working to prioritize the projects before construction can start. Reporting from the Capitol, I'm Courtney Ryan.